Today we're going to talk about the physical size of the resistor and its wattage rating and how they coincide with each other. Now I have a 1 watt, half watt, quarter watt, and 1 eighth of a watt. And this is a caliper. I'm going to be measuring in inches and I'm going to show you how to determine the wattage of each resistor and it's really easy. Here you see a chart and this shows you the physical casing size of the resistors. And these are measured in inches. And as I demonstrated before I have the one watt, the half watt, the quarter watt, and the eighth watt resistor. This is the 1 watt resistor. And the measurement on each case in the resistors will be off because they're not built to precise. So we're going to be looking for a measurement close to 0.562. And the actual physical size that I get from this is. 0.467 which is close enough to that. I would never suspect something this large to be a half watt. I would expect it to be a one watt. Now we're going to move on to the half watt resistor. And I'm reading get a little closer. 0.375, which is spot on. Quarter watt resistor. Point two sixty four. This is close enough to 2.25 uh, and the 1 8th watt and I got a reading of 0.166 I could probably go a little bit closer I got 0.1 55 and that's 0.145. Now this pertains to just these carbon film resistors with casings like these. We're not going to be talking about the ceramic one. Ceramic resistors have different sizes for different wattages and resistance. For instance, this is a ceramic resistor. It's a 5 watt resistor. It's a 2 ohm. Or it's a uh, one's a 2 ohm resistor, 2.2 ohm. Yeah, they're both 2.2 ohm. The R is a point, so 2.2 ohm resistor, 5 watt. For another instance, here is a 5 watt resistor. And I believe it is a either a 17 ohm resistor or it's a point one a point zero one seven resistor. So it's a very lower resistance. Now notice the sizes of that. That is a very much smaller case in size than that resistor. These are power resistors used mostly for power supplies. You also can have the smaller 1 8 resistors in there. And here's a quarter watt. So, and power circuits and power boards use varied sizes of resistance for each application. So, I hope you learned something today. Please check out my other videos. The next video in line will be the color code resistance. 
and I will be talking about the different resistant color codes and be demonstrating them with these. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Leave me a comment if you want. I'll see you next time.